Hi, today we're in Paris in a photo studio. We're about to make some cinemagraphs of Carly and Joan for House of Style. We are See, almost good. done with hair and makeup and we're gonna throw a gorgeous dress on and go shoot to the opener for MTV House of Style today. A cinemagraph is something in between a photo and a video. It's a living moment. We'll take a cinematic idea and turn it into a photo. So we're able to tell more story that way. It removes the flatness of a photograph. This gives it like a three-dimensional quality, but still you read it like a photograph. It's gonna be nice to see how we're gonna move with a cinemagraph. This is probably the first of many cinemagraphs we'll be doing, Joan. Jamie's been a photographer her whole life. She really has that photographic eye. Mine's more technical. I'll do the traditional photography aspect to the editing, the color, the crop, the retouch, and then he'll do the frame-by-frame uh, -frame animation. Basically, it's like takes the photograph and stitches in the moment that's gonna live in it. When we first started, we did a lot of dress, movement, hair, Flowing. It was kind of natural for fashion to have that, to yeah. illustrate clothes in that way. A lot of times we'd be out experimenting and we'd shoot some raw footage and then see something happen. One of our first ones, a cafe window. And initially it was going to be the sparkling lights in the window, but then I saw this cab go by in the footage and I was like, well, maybe that'd be cool. So we've been uh, planning some shots. We have a few ideas down. So we have our shot list. We're going to start in the mirror. We built the set. Joni, I think this thing weighs more than a small child. <laughs> it's it's okay. gorgeous, though. So you guys are going to be leaning here in the mirror, looking all chic and glittery, and we're going to have lights hopping around you so you're sparkling. Oh, look, this can move. Hot mama. That's cute. That was cute. Jonah, we like where you s we're standing. Don't move from there. Can you see me? Because I can't see myself. Beautiful. Right into the camera. When we're looking for a scene, we'll pick it like a normal photograph. You know, we'll approach it from a photography point of view, like would this make a good photograph? Sometimes motion will happen naturally, or sometimes we'll have to create it. But you always watch for it and you know, the same way a photographer knows when they got the shot, we know when we have the moment. We are on our second Gucci look, and can't wait to see what's going to move this time. So what I'm going to do first is I'm going to do a bunch of these. And you're gonna hold still, but you can change poses every time I start over. Oh, okay. okay. How's that? With cinemagraphs, you have to know what makes a cinemagraph. You have to know how to control it, or look for it, or see it. Mentally, on set, we collaborate on that kind of thought process. And you're actually gonna be a still photograph, and you're gonna do some like outrageous, like fashion pose, and, like the cords flying, and it looks like. Frozen moment that she's shooting. Cool, 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 cool. And then when we go back to the studio, when we edit, we'll sit down, we'll go through, we'll do marks of all the moments that are potential cinematographs. And do the same, we're just gonna roll. Looks really good. Yeah, oh yeah, you can change head positions. That's, that's good. You can move. Yeah, you can move if you want to. I love that one. That was just so like, this, this simple, it was graphic, it was striking. Yeah, and they looked amazing. Legs go like, forever. It's so unfair. Tumblr's been really integral in, in what we've done. As an artist, it's interesting because then you really see what did this mean to someone. You don't always get that. Yeah. People don't walk up to a painting and leave a note for the artist and say, This made me feel A, B, or C. But with Tumblr and social media, you get that. And it can still it can live on. We have a New York City one where the subway train is going by. That one is still going. It's like completely viral. We did a series with Coco Rocha. She's wearing Oscar de la Renta and romantic leaning over the balcony in all of Manhattan and her hair is blowing. Joan! What? It's a tower! Oh my god! Oh. We have really good shoots. We've created an environment so people are comfortable. The vibe is really chill. It's very down to earth. Just because the most important thing is making beautiful imagery. Let's try bringing Kylie your arm back up. Yeah, I think we're good. good. All right, cut. So let's pop down to the street. Right, last one, last shot. It's really interesting shooting because 
There's no guide to do it. There's no rules to do it. We try new things and we find what works and we push the new medium. When you get to that final moment where it's, it's animated and it's living and it's, it's beautiful, it is magical.